I'm gonna explain to you guys what we're doing, where we're going, and how we're gonna do it. It's gonna take us like 12 days to do it. Look how cool. We're stuck. And we missed her dentist appointment. Gotta get her up. Got stuck. The car is actually stuck like this. We've been trying to get it out, but the wheel just keeps spinning. I just called Jordan. He's gonna come with the pickup truck and maybe he can pull us out. He says he can. I've been trying to push it and put it in neutral and stuff, but it's not moving. They just did this whole driveway, so it's all like fresh soil. This is gonna take a while, you might as well come out. Nice and muddy. Nice and muddy. Look, not that much of a stretch to get it on the ground. Car's on the ground. We're still stuck and waiting for Jordan to get here with his pickup truck. We also called a mobile mechanic. He should be here hopefully in the next 20 minutes with some straps. Sucks! Because he was saying, like, obviously, if I go forward, I might run the risk of scraping. <laughs> so, yeah, don't get stuck, too. Do you know who owns that car? Because I'm thinking, like, if, if he pulls me, I don't want to touch his car either, right. right? I'm just trying to think. But they're stuck. Because the dumpster. Oh, so, yeah. I don't think I'm going to back it up, then. I'm going to try to back it up. Okay. Yeah, we got it. Do you think he'll pay for it? Oh yeah, get it quoted and call them. Oh, okay. You got pictures of everything. Yeah. Oh my god, look how deep that is. Yeah, it just like sunk right in. Thank you. Yep. So then they just... They just made up. everything. Yeah. I'm gonna keep putting these pylons here so that way... This guy doesn't do the exact same thing I did. Yeah. Oh yeah, she's gonna... I swear she wasn't out here earlier. All right. All right, thank you. I'm gonna take a picture of this. I'm gonna give them a call. They can pay for it. Something's hanging. I know. I so when we moved here, we went through all the northern states. We saw so much of the United States that we wanted to see. But then on the way back, when we had to drop off the camper, we did the exact same road. Because I thought I didn't really need a GPS towards the end, when we got towards Minnesota, we ended up going into South Dakota by accident. But the nice thing is we saw the geography being so nice, we were really uh, fascinated by what it looked like. So this time, we're gonna go even more south. I need to clean the inside of the car, it's disgusting. So dirty, so dirty. People have asked us why we don't wanna just drive through Canada since we're in Canada. I mean, obviously there's parts of Canada that we would love to see. There's a few things about going through the States that makes just more sense. Uh, gas is cheaper. There's a lot more places to stop, like hotels and motels along the way. The geography of the United States. I also heard that the drive through Canada is a lot more, a lot more boring. <laughs> Maybe I'll give like a very quick, brief summary of where we're going and just the cities we're hitting. Just so that way everyone knows what's happening. It's happening in two weeks. I don't know if 
you guys remember, but the last time we went, we actually bought a Explorer, Ford Explorer, just for the road trip. So here's the truck that we just bought for under a thousand bucks. It's pretty sweet. Leather seats, sunroof, nice back, lots of space. Bear's little crate thing is in there already. Trailer, I'm gonna hook up the trailer right now because we're literally leaving right now. And then we sold it over there. Not only did we wash our car here the last time we left, I feel like this is everything, every time we do this road trip, we always have to start here. <laughs> There's so much noise. I'm just gonna head home and explain where we're going and what cities we're gonna go to. Just give me a second. There you go. So much quieter. <laughs> if you guys are interested, let's go through all the details. All right, so I'm just gonna go really quickly through like just a quick overview of where we're going and all the cities we're gonna hit. All right, so we're starting in Canada. So what Yakima, Washington, Baker City, Oregon, Hepburn, Idaho, then Salt Lake City, Fruita, Colorado, Denver, Colorado, then we're gonna go Wekini, Kansas, Kansas City, Missouri, St. Louis, Missouri, Greenville, Indiana, Maryville, Ohio, Niagara Falls, Ontario, and then right back into Canada, we're gonna go to my parents' house, then to Don's parents' house. So it's gonna be wild. So all the gas stations we're gonna to try to fill up at are gonna be Shell's. So I signed up for a membership there. And then I signed up for a membership for all of our hotels, and they're gonna be all Super 8s. Hopefully there's, I think there's swimming pools at every single hotel or most of them. We will see a lot more things if we drive only four hours a day because of August and because of bear. And I've been using TikTok just to kind of figure out like what to do and exhibits about dinosaurs. There's waterfalls, zoos, and like tons of parks. So August will be able to run around, stretch your leg. And I really hope I could post every day. If you guys have any suggestions, write in the comments below what we need to go check out. Is there anything that you guys want to see in the videos? Let me know.